Hello everyone, welcome back to Scott's Exclusives. I'm Scott and here's some exclusives. Canadian that is. As you may be aware, I am doing the Canadian stuff for Matt Zion. I still send him stuff, he got those Lay's trips from me, but he also just figures, hey, you're in Canada, go review it. Now the whole idea of that was to do things like at KFC or Pizza Hut, the Canadian exclusives there, and I've not been able to actually get any of those yet. Because they haven't really done any lately, outside of the sandwich that burned my mouth. That's a thing. But I've done candy bars, I've done chips, and I actually have cola this time. Max favorites cola. Now, Max is like a 7-Eleven. Um, like it's it's a it's a gas station convenience store kind of thing. It's a big chain. Way back when it used to be called Mike Smart and then Max Milk and all those things. So um yeah. They have their own cola. Now, if you go into Max, you can usually get two two liters of Coke for like three dollars, or it's a dollar ninety nine each, or two fifty. Different things like that. Coke, Pepsi, you name it. Um, now they have their own, and it's distributed by Elemention Couchetard Inc. out of Laval, Quebec. And you can visit their website at couchetard.quebec. Um, I looked up Max to see their history, and they're actually owned by a company named Elemention Couchetard since 99. So that's the parent company making Coke. Um, on the front of it, it's got like th this mountain kind of scape looking thing and it says, Fizz Guzzle, ah, you're speaking my language. What? On the French side, it's psh, glue, glue, ah. What? <laughs> Seriously, what the hell is this? Why does Max have their own Cola. Like, they, they probably looked at how much they're selling and figured, hey, let's do this. So, I'm going to open this up, and we're going to try some of this. Um, I have no expectations whatsoever, because there's always the joke of Coke and Pepsi and then RC Cola. This is going to be on the rung below that, right? Like, there's no-name brands, and then there's this. This is new. I haven't seen this before, like, this past week or so. This kind of blows my mind that it exists. So, I'm going to try this out. And uh, while I'm pouring this out, be sure to check out Zion Mainframe Gaming. Also, check out Guilty Pleasure Cinema. The first is the website that Matt Zion runs on, on here with his channel. I do gaming on there with him as well. Guilty Pleasure Cinema is my site. That's where I do movie reviews and stuff like that. There's also my channel as well and all that fun stuff. So, I actually did that without pouring it and said, do it while I pour it. Ha, go view it anyway. It's fun stuff. So, do I need to smell it? I think I should smell it. Let's smell it. How does this smell? It smells like cola. There's a sharpness to it. So, uh, I got my Igloo Cool Cup. It's Canada, whatever. I mean, I'm not going to make it so you can see it. It's freaking cola, and you can see it through the thing. I really don't know what to expect out of this. Wow, that's lame. That's really lame. Perfectly drinkable. Um, I was gonna say there's no carbonation, but I just burped from it. It seems like there's nothing to it. Like there's no bite, no nothing. Cause like Coke has kind of a sugary like sweetness to it and a tartness. And Pepsi I always found is a little sour in comparison. And then RC Cola is cheap. This is cheaper than that. It, it's thin. Really, really thin. Depending on your mood, I mean, if you don't want the sugariness of Coke, I usually do Coke Zero myself or uh, Pepsi Next, stuff like that, like the cut back on the sugars if I'm drinking it. This might actually be a pretty good alternative. Um, it's not bad. It's just... It's the difference between buying a name brand and then not. Um, it's perfectly serviceable. I give it a middle of the road three. It's it's not bad. It's just no Coke or Pepsi. It's it's a thin stupid lid. It's a thin cola. 
Personally, I kind of prefer that. I don't like the, the fuzziness you get on the teeth from Coke. Um, fizz guzzle, ah, you're speaking my language. Uh, yeah, this was the usual, like, dollar fifty, two bucks, whatever it is. I honestly don't remember, but I gotta think it's cheaper than Coke or Pepsi when you buy it from Max because they're undercutting it. Uh, I gotta think that's their whole intent, because otherwise, why are you selling your own Coke? Really, why? Or, sorry, cola. So, three. Um, it doesn't fail at being cola, but it also doesn't excel at it. It just is. It's kind of bland. It's kind of a boring review. Sorry, but it's just exclusive to Canada. It's exclusive to Max. You can't go to any other store and get this. You just go to Max. And Max are common. They're like a 7-Eleven. They're pretty common. So, yeah, Max Cola, three out of five. Thanks for watching. We'll see you tomorrow. Right